Right, everyone, welcome back. So here we go. Which do I choose? Um, well, I'm guessing if you say I intend to open it, that's probably leading you down the bad path because that's what that Isadora did. And I've been good throughout the game, so I think this is the the better choice, and I'm going to go with this one. I plan to leave the repository as it is. I'm pleased to hear that. I've been thinking. What is it, Professor? I spent all year trying to keep our journey a secret from everyone, including Professor Weasley. But now I wonder if I should have shared it with her and the others sooner. Trusted them more. The Keepers wanted this secret to be locked away forever. How long will you keep it? The Keepers were right. The risk of using this magic is too dangerous. It is my responsibility alone to keep it safe. I understand, but you are not entirely alone. I will do all I can to help you. God. The arrogance of wizard kind. Goblins built this repository. It belongs to us. Enough, Ranrock. It was never yours. I've been wanting to play with this. Miriam's wand. If she'd simply handed over the container, all of this could have been avoided. Foolish, self-important witch. <coughs> Seems you were two of a kind. She didn't know when to give up either. <laughs> No way, did Professor Fig just die there? Oh, well, here we go. What the entire game's been building up to. Defeat Ranrock. Hang on. Now I can damage it. Gotta watch out for another colour. Yellow. Nice. Looks like I've got to follow it. Purple. Oh, red. Nice. Oh, 
Oh, did not think I was up, but I could get a little cheap hit in on it with it. Never mind. It's quite a cool end and fight, to be honest. Yellow. Purple. Nice. Come on, dodge that. Shielded again. Yellow. Red. Oh. Should have protected. My bad. Purple. Yellow. Nice. Second stage done. Down here, yeah. You can't run. There's no way to hide now that one. Final stage. Alright, we got Let yellow. Go. Alright, we got red. And we got purple. I didn't manage to get much hits in there. All right, yellow. God, heal up. Do not die now. Chipping away. Yellow. Oh, really? Nice.
Oh, come on. Why do my spells not work there? Oh, for God's sake, I've missed it again. Really? Finally. Oh my god. God, I'm getting absolutely smoked, do you? Good job, I've got 25 portions in it. Jesus. Heal, heal, heal. My god, I've been playing War Long all week and I can't even block on this game. Nice. Come on. I think I've done it.
Miriam. I can't believe that. I thought he was dead. He came back and then he died. <laughs> I, can't, I can't believe that. The game's just pure pulled on his heartstrings. <clears throat> professor Eleazar Fig. I dare say he was a beloved professor to many of you. Certainly a long-standing colleague to his peers. A famed adventurer and seeker of knowledge, he built a reputation charging into the unknown, brazenly disregarding both discretion and safety, providing perhaps a rather unfortunate lesson for us all. His devotion to adventure was rivaled only by his dedication to Hogwarts. And of course, to his wife, Mary, uh, Midi, um, whom we lost much too soon as well. <clears throat> Professor Fig represented the best of all of us. Oh, he could be deviously clever possessed a brilliantly inquisitive mind and was the most loyal of friends. But perhaps it was his remarkable courage for which we will all be forever indebted to him. If not for Professor Fig, I can say with confidence that if not for him, many of us, let alone Hogwarts, would not be here today. Those that knew him best will agree that we must now honor him as only Hogwarts can, by wisely, resourcefully, justly, and bravely facing all that lies ahead. <clears throat> to Professor Fig. Please meet me as soon as can't believe we lost Fig. I didn't know him as well as you did, but I know he was a good man. Glad Weasley spoke for him. She honored him well. Fig will be well remembered. I wish the same could have been done for my uncle. I wonder if there's a chance Anne would meet me. Sebastian, I can't imagine what you and Anne are going through. Perhaps you'll hear from her soon. I hope so. I, I'll let you know. Sebastian, there's something you should know. It's to do with Victor Rookwood. I heard a rumor that he confronted you outside of Ollivander's. Sounds as if he faced quite a fight. The rumors are true, and I did. But it's not that. Just before Rookwood attacked, he uttered something familiar. The same words Anne heard before she was cursed. Children should be seen and not heard. Wait. What? What are you saying? It wasn't one of Ranrock's loyalists who cursed Anne. It was Rookwood. It was Rookwood all along. This... this can't be. It was the Loyalists. It's always been them. The night Anne was cursed, all she saw were goblins. Once Rookwood allied with Ranrock, Isadora's estate became of interest to them both. 
That's why Rookwood was there the night Anne was cursed. He was working with Ranrock. When he saw your sister, well, he didn't want anyone to know. So he cursed her, and she's never been the same. So cruel. Rookwood deserved what he got. Thank you for telling me. It wasn't a goblin. I suppose I owe you an apology. All this time I thought goblins were the enemy. But it was never that simple. Ominous said he's spoken with Anne. I wonder if she'll see me. I'll find out and send word when I know more. Congratulations, you've completed the story of Hogwarts Legacy and reached the end of your school year. With your owl exams fast approaching, now is a good time to review your field guide progress. Explore the world, finish any remaining relationship storylines and side quests and complete your field guide as you see fit. Nice! So I've finished. That's the main story done. Right, I swear I got a, I think I got a mail. From, yeah, oh, here we go. Speak with Natty near Manor Cape. Meet Poppy in the Great Hall. Right, let's go and see if we can conclude these then. See if we can start wrapping up. I think I've got to wait for Sebastian as well. You, my young friend. Just the person I was hoping to see. I see Doran finally convinced you to leave the smidgets. If anyone can keep them out of poacher hands, it's the centaurs. And I wanted to thank you. When the poachers ambushed us, I... It was nice not to face them alone. Of course. It's the sort of thing friends do for each other, isn't it? I suppose so. I am glad you came to Hogwarts. It's already been my best year. I wouldn't want a repeat of Hauntel Hall, of course, but I did enjoy the Three Broomsticks. Had no idea how lovely it was there. Had you never been to the Three Broomsticks? I used to spend most of my time with Highwing. And, well, I don't know how Serona feels about hippogriffs popping in for a butterbeer. Highwing's the only one I would have gone with. Or Gran, of course. Nothing wrong with that. Highwing's good company. She is. Although I am beginning to see the appeal of, uh, human friends. It was nice to talk about my parents and Gran with someone. And share Highwing. I don't suppose you've heard anything from your parents, have you? I haven't, but I'm perfectly fine with that. Does your Gran know that we found the Snidgets? I couldn't hold it in any longer. I told her everything. She was livid that I'd been anywhere near the poachers, but she confessed that she was rather envious about the Snidgets. It has all been a pleasure, Poppy. Do try and stay out of trouble. Don't know that I can. We've taken on poachers twice now, successfully. I rather think you've helped me develop a taste for it. And with centaurs as allies, I might actually go looking for trouble. You and I should meet for a butterbeer soon. Perhaps Highwing can join us? Oh, nice. There's got a trophy called Beast Friends, so I'm guessing that's Poppy's quest line finished with. It's tormenting! Right. Speak with Sebastian. And then we'll go and see Natty as well. Right, need to go to the Undercroft.
I'm glad you came. Sebastian, I've received your owl. What's happened? Ominous spoke with Anne about what happened with my Uncle Solomon. She believes I should pay for what I did, but she won't turn me in. She said the guilt I'll have to live with is punishment enough. I'm so sorry, but I'm glad you know that you can at least try to move on now. The thing is, I think I've lost my sister, my twin, forever. She refuses to even see me. I can't blame her. I couldn't really blame any of you if you gave up on me entirely. You all believed in me, and I let you all down. Anne may just need some time. Surely one day she'll be able to forgive you. I hope you're right. I realize I can't undo what's been done, but I can try every day to make up for it. I owe you an ominous everything for standing by me. Well, it wasn't easy. But I believe in you, Sebastian. I've had a sense about you since that first day in Defense Against the Dark Arts. Seems so long ago. Thank you. I have no idea what's to come, but I'm grateful for your friendship. I'm glad you came to Hogwarts. Nice. A Salor Grave trophy just popped as well. So that must be Sebastian done. We just got Natty now. I'm hoping as well. Let's have a look. Quests. Alright, so there's the main story. I've got two more side slash relationship. So what was it? Harlow's last stand. So speak with Natty in a manor cape. The last two must be with Natty then, I'm guessing. So we might as well keep it going while I've got the time. I'll try and get them done in this, this one. Ready to finish Harlow. Yes. I'm ready to finish Harlow once and for all. What is your plan? I received an owl from Mrs. Bickle. She wondered if we were having any luck going after Harlow. Suggested we could gather evidence from a friend near Manor Cape. But she warned us to stay out of it. Was rather adamant about it. Precisely. Harlow knows that we saved Archie and that we rescued Mr. Rabe. The letter didn't come from Mrs. Bickle, did it? I do not believe it did. Hallow intends to ambush us. But now we have the upper hand. We can prepare. We are stronger than Hallow, and he knows it. That's why he's resorting to this sort of trickery. We must go. Agreed. Let's finish this. Brilliant. Hallow's reign ends today. Perhaps we ought to inform Officer Singer of our plans. I already sent her an owl to let her know that we were following a lead given to us by Mrs. Bickle. Are you concerned she might tell your mother? Indeed she will, but so be it. I am tired of hiding it from her. My mother needs to understand that I will not be safe from the Ashwinders until everyone is. I shall pursue them until they are finished, and I think she knows that. As do you. Oh, I've been here before Where as well. Rebellion. Look oh, here we go. Bombarda. What's the 
Nice. Little Nat's Iona, in it, and her excruciatingly loyal companion. You two have done quite a bit of damage to my business interests. <laughs> but I must gradually give you some credit. What was once a mere annoyance has become remarkably problematic. Fortunately, I pride myself on my problem-solving skills. He's been a bit of a strange character, this one. He hasn't really been that involved, has he, really? I can't believe it. Let me use a Vada Kedavra on him. Oh, God. This is mad. Are you sure you are up for a visitor? Yes, Mother. I feel fine, and it will do me good to see my friend. Very well. But do not overdo it, Natsai. I know, Mother. Well, she seems okay, which is good. Can I talk to her or... There we go. It is good to see you, my friend. I'm glad to see you're doing so well. I am doing better than it appears. I am only here because my mother insisted just to be safe. I was relieved when she told me that you were all right. Only because of you. How are you feeling? Well, I've had better days, but Nurse Blaney says that I am on the mend. I'm sorry, Natty. It's my fault you got hurt. What? No. Do not blame yourself for this. The moment that I saw Harlow aim his wand at you, well... You quickly made the choice to protect me. I did what I had to, and I would do it again. I could not simply stand there and let you get hurt. Then I shouldn't feel guilty. Of course not. There was nothing that you... Oh. Oh, my. I cannot believe that it took me this long to see it. He made a choice. Based on instinct, my father, you, my friend, are no more to blame for my injuries today than I am to blame for my father's sacrifice years ago. From what I know of him, it seems there's a lot of your father in you. That's very kind of you to say. I hope that you are right. This has all been a bit much, hasn't it? A battle here at Hogwarts. Everything we have done to take down Harlow and the rest of Rookwood's lot. But we have done it. Rookwood is dead, Harlow is on his way to Azkaban, and the rest of them are on the run. A few of the dregs will still be about, fighting for their lost cause. But Rookwood's enterprise has fallen apart. Everything is safer now because of us. Because of you. Thank you, but we make a formidable team. You, my fellow traveler, have enriched my time at Hogwarts beyond anything I could have imagined. Thank you. I believe your friendship to be one of the most important in my life. Thank you for coming to visit me. Oh, Does nice. There's Natty's done as well. The Avenging Gazelle trophy unlocked. And I've just reached level 40 as well. Nice. Right, well, 
I know there's a trophy for spending all your talent points, so I might as well stick this last one on. Um, what should we stick it on? Arrest on momentum, Expelliarmus. We'll use it on Expelliarmus. Right, so. Have I got anything to check? I made the right decision as well to cut that last part where I did because I wouldn't have had enough time to fit all of this in. So I did make the right decision, which I'm glad. Right, I have a bunch of gear that I probably should go and sell because... Oh, hang on. I should be able to claim this last one. Nice. 100% on everything. Um, collections. Uh, I'm missing one, but I'm technically not because it's additional content. So I've got everything there as well. Why, where's it? Where's the new one? Why can't I take it off? Oh, well, I must have got it. So, the only thing I need then is these. I need to go and buy these two conjurations. So what I'll do while I've still got time, I'll go to Hogsmeade. I'll go to my shop. Get rid of what I don't need. See how much money I've got. See how much I need left. And then I'll get those last two and then I should be 100% complete. Right, Penny. Take that, take that. Take it all. Right, I have 2,900. What the hell? <laughs> what on earth just happened there? Um, right, who is it who sells them? Is it Tom? It's is it Tom's and Scrolls? Just let me know if there's something in particular. Ah, yes, it is. Right, so I literally need one more, and it's 2,000. So I'm 1,600-ish away. Oh, I'm very pleased here. Right, I literally just need the last one, and then I, th I should be done. That, the, that one doesn't count, and then I should have everything. Um... So what I'll do then... I'll go and get the money. Just because I'll have to go and like farm catching beasts and selling them and blah de blah. Um, oh, actually, do you know what? I'm trying to think. Trying to think where there's a legendary chest at because now I'm level 40. Rebellion. I can start opening them. I tell you what, I know where one is off the top of my head. So I'll just go to that now. And I'm, I'm just, I'm just curious about what I'll get. Uh, where is I'm trying to look for the trophy room? I'll go and get the one that's in the headmasters. It's like up in the top tower. I know where it is. I just can't describe where it is. Right. So if we go along here. I'm just curious as to what the actual gear will be. Because now I'm literally going to end up getting like the best of the best. It's through like a door here. Is it this one? Yeah. Right. What are we going to get? Unidentified. Is there any more further along? Just trying to think. Is 
Yes, there is. Revelio. There's also a thing there that I've never done. Right. So, let's have a look at this one then. Right, a neck item this time. See, I can go around and get all these now, because I'm the top level, so... The gear literally cannot get any better than it is. Right, there's nothing up here. I'll go and see what we've got then. We'll go and have a little peek at what we got. So, I've finished the game. You've made marvellous improvements but here. There was one quest left. Oh my god, they're worse than what I've got. No way. The keeper's wand. Right. One was neck. Oh my god, it's actually worse than what I've got. Right, and then... Alright, oh well. Never mind then. Yeah, so... 100% on challenges. Nearly 100% on collections. I still have this to do. So what I'll do is I'll do one final part. Or I'm hoping it'll be one final part. Surely there can't be that much more because... The game's like basically over. So I'd like to think that I could fit whatever's left into one more part. And then what I'll have to do for me platinum is I'll have to play through each of the other three houses and get to the map chamber for each one of them trophies. And then I should be able to get me platinum. So I'll leave it there for now, guys, because I've been going for, I think, about 40 minutes or so. Um, and then yeah, hopefully we can we can squeeze everything else into one more part. So, as always, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you could like the video, comment, share it around, subscribe, I'd really really appreciate it. Um, and I hope wherever you all are, you are having a wonderful day, and I'll see you on the final part. I hope. All right, take care, everyone. Bye bye.